Hi, this is Dhruv Patani from PhoneArena.com and this is a camera review of the Micromax E111 Canvas Doodle. The Canvas Doodle comes with an 8 megapixel camera at the back with dual LED flash and a 2 megapixel camera at the front. The rear camera records 720p videos at 30 frames per second while the front camera records videos at 480p resolution. The camera interface is a stock interface with no changes at all but a few extra settings options. The viewfinder occupies the majority of the screen while the right side has the gallery shortcut key at the top, the shutter key below it and an option to choose photographs, panorama or video below it. Just to the left of the settings panel, there is a front and back camera toggle at the top with a vertical zoom slider below it. Below the zoom slider we have the settings icon which has a lot of options. Clicking on the settings icon lets us choose the flash settings, white balance, exposure and a wide variety of scene modes. Below it there are three set of settings with various options like picture size, picture quality, focus mode, color effect, face detection, touch autofocus and saturation. Contrast and sharpness options are also available. You can select the ISO and there is an option to enable red eye reduction as well. Let us now check out a few sample shots with the camera in daylight. As you can see the details in the image are very good but the colors are not very true. They seem a little washed out. Let's now check out some of the macro images. The image quality is very good in the macro photographs where the close up objects are very detailed but still the colors seem to be washed out. Now let's check out a few sample shot indoors under low light conditions. The first one was shot in normal mode and as you can see the noise is high and the details are missing. When shot in night mode there was no noticeable change and the noise continued to exist. When taken with the flash we saw that the image was relatively better with better details. Let us now check out a video sample taken with the phone. As you saw the video was average and the edges were slightly over sharpened. Considering the price of the device, the camera features and the quality of the images, the camera performance is quite average. Do hit the like button if you enjoyed watching our video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.